how how to find 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 wines wines that won't won't empty your your wallet. So I'm having pizza with some friends in my house and talk about value. When you're having pizza, you don't want to spend a lot of money on wine. What I look for, Chianti Classico. I mean, this is, I don't want to say poor man's Brunello, but you have the same quality as a lot of Brunellos at half the price. Going out to dinner in New York is tough to find value wines, but one tip that I can give you is that if you go to finer French restaurants, the best wines sometimes I find for the price are wines from the Languedoc region. This is because many of the sommeliers are from France. They know the wines, they've searched out these wines, and they're relatively unknown, which means they're a great bargain and a great value. My tip in the hunt for value, put other people to work for you. As executive editor of Wine Spectator, I depend on the hard work of a lot of talented people to help me produce the magazine. When I'm in a restaurant or wine shop, I follow a similar approach. Depend on the people who work there to point me to a good bottle at a fair price. I happen to know every single restaurant in my neighborhood that offers either um, no corkage or a very, very small fee for bringing your own bottle of wine in, and I frequent those places. Um, I'm always very generous when I do bring my own bottle in. I think it's a very um, kind service that restaurants offer patrons. I always check out the half bottles. My wife and I seldom finish a whole bottle of wine at dinner anyway, and if the restaurants put together a good selection, a half bottle is a great way to drink good wine at half the cost. Also, over several courses, half bottles let you drink a white wine with the fish and a red with the meat. Or you can try two different reds for the cost of one. I don't go wine shopping unprepared. Impulse buys can be a really fun way to learn, but when I'm on a budget, I want to make the most of my money. So since I run WineSpectator.com, I use a lot of the great value tools on our website. The free daily wine picks on our homepage always features a great value wine under $15. And I use that to plan ahead, picking out wines for upcoming parties or dinners, not just for myself. And that way I can buy 12 bottles at a time and get the great case discounts offered by many retailers.